those who teach us of our creation and our past, so we may preserve Mother Earth for ancestors yet to come. We are the land. This is dedicated to our relatives before us thousands of years ago and to the 150 million who were exterminated across the Western Hemisphere in the first 400 years' time, starting in 1492. To those who have kept their homelands and to the nations extinct due to mass slaughter, slavery, deportation, and disease unknown to them, and to the ones who are subjected to the same treatment today, to the ones who survived the relocations and the ones who died along the way. To those who carried on traditions and lived strong among their people. To those who left their communities by force or by choice and through generations no longer know who they are. To those who search and never find. To those that turn away the so-called non-accepted. To those that bring us together and to those living outside keeping touch, the voice for many. To those that make it back to live and fight the struggles of their people. To those that give up and those who do not care. To those who abuse themselves and others and those who revive again. To those who are physically, mentally, or spiritually incapable by accident or by birth. To those who seek strength in our spirituality and ways of life and those who exploit it, even our own. To those who fall for the lies and join the dividing lines that keep us fighting amongst each other. To the outsiders who step in, good or bad, and those of us who don't know better. To the leaders and prisoners of war, politics, crime, race, and religion, innocent or guilty. To the young, the old, the living, and the dead. To our brothers and sisters and all living things across Mother Earth. And her beauty we destroy and denied the honor that the Creator has given each individual, the truth that lies in our hearts, all my relations.